Hello everyone. Today I am going to show you how Microsoft Forms can be used to create online test. It is a similar application like Google Forms. To use Microsoft Forms, you need to have Microsoft email ID that could be Hotmail or Outlook. So you need to sign in first. Once you sign in with your Microsoft email ID, you will come on this window. The form are a kind of survey questionnaire and a quiz, a kind of online test. So I am going to show you now how to create online test that is quiz. Here now we will have to add some questions. First need to give the title say geography. You can add image by clicking over here. You can upload. In instructions, in <coughs> description you can write instructions to solve this test and then you can proceed further for adding new questions. Now these are various options. These are the type of question, what type of question you want to add. You can browse three. First is MCQ. Second is short answer. Third is asking your opinion. Ne then next they are asking some date. They ask there are different kind of options you can just click on and browse it. Now I am going to show you how to insert first question. So this is a kind of MCQ question. So highest mountain in the world. Now you have to give the option, type the option, say K2, Mount Everest, you can add options, add options. the baby add options content jungle now these are the four options that I have given if you, you can see the tick mark over here I need to make the tick mark which is the right answer. So I am making tick mark here. So it means now this answer is marked as a correct answer. And what points, what marks are there for each question that you need to specify. So required question. Multiple answers. Sometimes there are some questions where two answers are correct and two marks are given. The next to add new question again it's not a question I am asking their name and their answer. So it's a long answer. It means the answer will be in the form of text. Then next where the questions where you want to tell them to give the rating 
to a particular experience or event. Next, I am just showing you different kind of options av available over here. See when you are asking them like birth date. So you need to get, select that option. The next. See you will see the tips over here. So you can put some processes over here the, or the steps or phases over here or numbers over here and they need to arrange it in proper order. In that case you can use this kind of question. So I am showing you how different options are available. What different kind of question you can ask. Okay, these are here you will give some statement and they will agree or disagree. Statement you give here a statement so they will respond to the statement. Next. Just see what options are there. If you want to ask some red thing, you will see the tip appeared over there. So it's like liking and not liking. So in this way different kind of questions can be added in the question paper. Once you added various questions and once your question paper is ready, then you can click on send option. Now various options to share the question paper are available. You can copy and simply you can paste it in WhatsApp group or in email. Or from here itself you can send the email.